السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته، أسعد الله صباحكم أبنائي الطلاب والطالبات، معكم الأستاذ خالد السبيعي. I'm gonna teach you the English language, the intermediate stage, the second intermediate grade, the second semester. We are here on Unit 6, Omar in England. We will take the revision, the Saudi revision, on page 56 and 57. Before that, راح نركز على توجيهات وزارة الصحة، حيث وجهت وزارة الصحة على لبس الكمامة في الأماكن المزدحمة وما نلبس الكمامات إلا إذا كنا مثلا في أماكن مزدحمة أو إذا كنا نعاني من الكحة أو السعال. أيضا غسل اليدين ولمدة تقريبا 40 ثانية إلى 50 ثانية أو أكثر ونطهر اليدين بعد لمس أي معدن. وأيضا أداب العطاس والكحة وهي استخدام المنديل وتجنب التجمعات قدر المستطاع لأكثر تزيد عن أكثر من 50 شخص. Okay, we will back to our lesson, our book, The Left Off. First of all, for the left of the Saudi revision, we're going to take the first question is uh, five, five sentence and we will put the correct parts between one to five and A to E. Read and write. Before that, look at some instruction about my journey to the international school. The look, then look at a, a project about travel. Before that, do you remember our last lesson about Umar? And Fred, Omar, طبعا راح لإنجلند. Omar in England. This is the unit about Omar in England. Omar راح لإنجلند. He's wearing the the clothes for the school, the international school that he went to, and he met with the Fred. And let's take the instruction. Let's take his journey about the first day on the international school. First of all, one, when you leave the house, what you gonna do? عندما تغادر المنزل ماذا سوف تفعل؟ When you leave the house, will you sit down and be comfortable؟ هل سوف تجلس وتشعر بالارتياح؟ وين راح اجلس فيه؟ When I'm gonna sit. So A is wrong. We will not choose A on one. When you leave the house, wait for the bus. سوف تنتظر الباص. سوف تنتظر الحافلة. We'll wait. This may be correct, maybe not. Let's go to the C. Get off and go to class. تنزل من الحافلة وتروح للصف. No, you still you not on the bus. Let's go to D. Get on and buy a ticket. أذهب وأشتري تذكرة. Where? Where can I get on and buy a ticket? Still, D is absolutely not correct. Walk to the bus stop. Let's take. We have B and E. One of them is correct. B is wait for the bus. When you leave the house, um, I'm going outside my house. I'm going to wait for the bus. So I'm going to wait for the bus. Or I'm going to walk to the bus stop. If I'm going to wait for the bus, where I'm going to wait it? Or I'm going to wait for the bus in the house? Or I'm going to عند محطة الباص محطة الحافلة Absolutely The correct answer will be E E will be here When you leave the house walk to the bus stop عندما تغادر المنزل اذهب إلى منطقة الحافلة وتنتظر هناك Then when you arrive at the bus stop عندما تصل لمنطقة الحافلة What you gonna do? You're gonna buy your ticket? From where you're gonna buy your ticket? You're gonna sit down and be comfortable? Where I'm gonna sit down? Will I wait for the bus? Or what? Absolutely will be B. Wait. I'm already in the bus stop. So I'm gonna wait for the bus. So two will be what? When you arrive at the bus stop, wait for the bus. It will be B. Let's go to three. When the bus comes, okay, the bus is coming. Now I'm gonna. I see the bus. I'm already leaving the house, and I'm already walking to the bus stop. And when the when you arrive at the bus stop, I'm gonna wait for the bus. So I'm still waiting for the bus. Now the bus is coming. الحافلة الآن موجودة. What I'm gonna do? Am I gonna sit down and be comfortable? Before that, how can I sit? I, did, I still I didn't enter to the bus stop. 
Will I get off and go to the class? هل سوف انزل واروح الفصل؟ انا لسه ما ركبت الحافلة. Will I go on and buy a ticket? راح اركب الحافلة واشتري التذكرة. Yes. It will be D. When the bus comes, you're gonna get down, get on and buy a ticket. You will buy your ticket when the bus comes. Four. When you find a seat. Okay. I am, I'm leaving the house. I'm already on, arrived on this bus stop. I'm also, the bus is coming. I'm, I'm getting on the bus and I'm buying my ticket. So I'm looking for my seat. When you find your seat, okay, this is my seat. What I'm gonna do if I find my seat? I'm gonna sit down and be comfortable or I'm gonna get off and go to the class. Absolutely, I'm gonna sit down and be comfortable. I find already, I find my seat. So I'm gonna sit down. Sit down from seat like this. Five, when you arrive at the school, okay. The bus is now going to the international school. Like you see, his journey to the international school. I'm already in the international school. I'm seeing now the school. I'm in the bus. I'm sitting down. I'm comfortable and I'm relaxed. And I'm seeing now the, uh, the school. What I'm gonna do? I arrive at the school. Absolutely, I will get off and go to my class, which will be C. Write the answers for 10 seconds. So, look at the some instruction about my journey to the international school. Omar is talking about his journey to the international school. He leaving the house. He walking to the bus stop. He arrive at the bus stop. He waiting for the bus. And when the bus comes, he getting on the bus and buy a ticket. When he buy a ticket, he will find his seat, his seat and will sit down and be comfortable and relax on his seat. Then, when he arrives at the school, when the bus goes to the school and he sees in the school, he will get off his bus, his seat, and go to his class immediately. After you take the answer, we have here, write the instruction as a sentence in the future. Now, focus on this. After we finish this question, when I leave the house. CI. We have here what? You. What does it mean, you? You means and. What does it mean, I? I means Anna. Imagine with me. تخيل معي. When I calling someone when he's behind me. He's giving his back behind me. When I say, hey you, hey you. I'm asking someone, hey you, hey hand, hey hand. He's giving his back to me. And he looked to me and he say, me. He didn't say I. He didn't see uh, you. He's saying me. Are you talking to me? Anna. When I say you. He will answer to me and say, me. And I said, hey, and Rad Ali, and the answer was, I. So the opposite for you is what? Is I. So here we are, we are talking about giving some instruction to someone at the present symbol. When you leave the house, when you leave the house, walk to the bus stop. What did happen when we put it on the future? What did we put it on the future? Now, we gave you the information. When you leave the house, we are going to go to Umar. When you get out of the house, you can go to the bus. When we put it on the future, what did we use it? When I leave the house, I will walk to the bus stop. I'm talking now. Okay, I'm going to remember the information. He said, when you go to the house, go to the bus stop. وانتظر فيها اوكي عندما انا اغادر المنزل سوف اذهب انا الى منطقه الحافله استخدمنا اي وي تشينج يو وذ اي 
when I look here, we write before it, I will walk to the bus stop. He's talking about himself now. Okay, my father, my mother, she told me the instruction. أبوي بلغني وقال لي لما تطلع من البيت رح إلى منطقة الحافلة. Okay, عندما أذهب أنا عندما أنا أغادر من المنزل أنا بتجه إلى منطقة الحافلة. I use I. Let's go here. Two. When you arrive at the bus stop. Okay. He said عندما تذهب إلى منطقة الحافلة. Okay. Let me imagine when you arrive عندما تذهب وأنت. Okay. When I arrive, we will change you. To I, so it will be when I arrive at the bus stop. Let's go to B. I will wait for the bus. And the man, I will wait for the bus. And the man, I will wait for the bus. And the man, I will wait for the bus. As here, when the bus comes, here we are talking about subject. I'm not talking about myself. I'm talking about the hafila. Here I'm not talking about the hafila. I'm talking about something. I'm not talking about myself. When the bus comes, where is D? I will like this. I will. So the magic word is I. The magic word is I, and I use after it will. I will. I will do that. I will do that. I will not do that. When we do the affirmative and the negative, that's how we change it to the future. If you add a lot, one, two, three, four, five, here we change you and you here, and we put I, and here before it we would do I will, I will, I will, I will, because what? Because here is the future. We talking about the future, and we change the sentence to the future. Take one minute to. Take the answers. طبعاً تقدر تأخذ بس تغير ال U هنا كاملة تحطها في بداية لها I وعند بداية الجملة الثانية تستخدم اللي هي I will. So تستخدم هنا I بدال U وهنا تستخدم before أي جملة هنا تستخدم I will. دون ملاحظاتك الآن. Okay, now we're going to the second question. We're going to read and complete the missing information. Okay, we have a lot of information and we need to be specific on this information. We're going to read the story, the sentence, a travel to and from our school. And we're gonna read it and complete the missing information. Before that, قبل هذا كله راح نقرأ القطعة راح نجاوب الصور. بس قبل هذا كله عشان أكون أنا ذكي شوي. هذه القطعة أنا متوفرة عندي الآن. Okay, I have the story and I have the picture. The first thing I do, I don't know what about the information about the story. أنا ما أدري وش القصة. I don't know anything about it. Okay, I'm gonna see. I have five picture. I have something written here, R6 student. Okay, we have here six student. Where is the six student? I'm gonna look الآن. أنا راح أبحث الآن عن الكلمة هذه. Six student. I have here eight. What else? I have here six student. Now I have a six student. في أي قطعة في أي نص أخذ اللي قبل بداية الكلمة قبل من النقطة إلى النقطة. I have a quarter of the class, six students catch a bus. Here I have the point. Good. I am going to catch six students. I reached the point. Okay. What's happening now? What is happening? I don't understand what is happening. What is happening here? What is it? We have here a bus. Here we have a bus. We have here now the bus. Okay. We have a bus. So what's happening? A quarter of the class, six students catch a bus. Okay. This is the bus. And this is the bus. Okay, what's what's the connection between them? What's the relationship between the two? And I have the picture here, bus. And I have here the word bus. And here the word six student. Okay, so he needs to know how many students using the bus. 
ليتس جو تو ريد نقرا القصه اوكي هان هو الان يبحث عن كم شخص استخدموا الحافله اف وي باك تو ذا ستوري وي اسك ستودنتس ان اور كلاس هاو ذي ترافل تو سكول اذا سالنا الطلاب كيف كيف انتقلوا او كيف ذي ترافل تو سكول كيف وصلوا الى المدرسه A third of the class, eight students. Third of the class, eight students. Thaman tullab, come by car. Okay, we have by car, we have eight students. Good. Six students by bus. A quarter of the class, six students catch a bus. Good. Five students, five of them, cycle, they use the cycle. To school. And three students take a train. And only two students go to school on foot. We made a graph to show the information. Okay. On the bus, راحت طلاب. On foot. بالمشي. هذه الصورة عبارة عن المشي. بالمشي. How many students walk on their foot to the school? We have already the answer. Two students on foot. Foot or oh, two students. So here will be two students. Okay. How many how many students cycle to the school? Cycle to the school. We have here five students. They cycle to the school. Good. How many students using the car? To walk. Using the car to go to the school. Let's look for the car. Well, here is the car. Okay, how many students use it? Eight. Okay, we have eight students using the car. Good. How many students use the train? Where is the train? Let's look for This is the train. How many students? Three students take the train. So I'm going to write here, three students using the train. The story is about how many We have. ست طلاب استخدموا الحافلة. We have طالبين بالمشي. Five است... خمس طلاب استخدموا السيكل. ثمان طلاب السيارة. ثلاث طلاب استخدموا الحافلة أو القطار. <تصفيق> نكتب الأجوبة. We have one minute to write the answer. Take one minute and write the answers. Okay, we're going now to the second page. We are here on page 57. First of all, we have the grammar. Read about uh, what this question with how and what. And we already take it, the appearance. أخذناها مسبقا on Omar when he's traveling to England for the, his first day in the intermediate in the international school appearance character and health appearance اللي هو المظهر العام character شخصية الشخصية الشخصية بشكل عام health واللي هي الصحة we use how and what نستخدم ماذا وكيف for the question أو عند الوصف وعند السؤال like an example here, what does the new student look like? I'm talking now about his appearance, المظهر العام. كيف يبدو? Well, the, he's, he's thin, he's tall. This is the answer. About the character, أتكلم عن الشخصية. What's your new teacher like? What's your new teacher like? Character, شخصية, شخصية المعلم. قاعد يسأل عن شخصية المعلم. Well, he is... Generous, he's kind, هو كريم, he's kind, he's polite, مؤدب. Health, how is your father? Is it okay? Is he okay? I'm talking now about your health, about your father, صحة الأب. Well, my father is okay and he's fine. Thank you for your asking. <coughs> We're going now. We have the question from one to six uh we're gonna take it quickly uh we were gonna match from one 
to A to F. How was your, how was your flight to Riyadh? It was good. We had a little rain. No, I'm not talking about uh, weather. I'm talking about your flight. And I got to talk about the trip. I'm not talking about the weather or the weather. He's thin and quite tall. And I'm not talking about the weather. Uh, she is getting better. I'm talking about your flight. I'm not talking about uh, an unth or muannaf. It was interesting. We learned about the we learned about the about the city. Okay, we're gonna take this. We learned about. We learned about the about. We learned uh, we learned about the city of Taif. We're gonna take off the about. No, we, I mean, well, I'm not talking about the city. And I'm not coming to Medina. Not very good. The plan. We have the plan here. The plan was very crowded. How was your flight to Riyadh? Well, we're gonna take E because the, I'm talking about the plan. Two. What was your uh, geography lesson uh, like? Geography. I'm talking about Taif city, so I'm going to choose D. What was the weather like when you were on holiday? I'm talking now about the weather. The weather is, it was sunny and little rain, so I'm going to choose here A. How was your meal at the restaurant? I'm talking about the meal or the meal. Meal, absolutely, we're going to take the food world. The food was delicious, but it was quite expensive. Take an F. How was your sister? I'm talking now about a girl. Absolutely, I'm going to choose she's getting better. So it will be the answer here will be C. What does your brother look like? What else? He's thin, quite tall, and ha he's short and has short, straight hair. I'm talking about your brother. I'm talking about someone. When he is your, yours, he is thin. I'm, I'm describing my brother. So I'm going to choose here B. Take the answer. And thank you very much for your listening for our class.